Welcome to the Exponent Express, where we try to get you the news as quick as possible. I'm Jillian Ellison. And I'm Kaylee Higgins. The Purdue Half Marathon and 5K is this Saturday morning. Yes, I couldn't possibly think of a better way to spend a Saturday morning than heaving uncontrollably. It's called being active, Kaylee. It's called cruel and unusual punishment. I thought that was working with you. Traffic restrictions will be in place from 8 a.m. till noon. Cherry Lane, State Street, University, Waldron, Martin Jischke, and MacArthur Drives will all be closed throughout the day. So basically every single road on campus is going to be closed. Good luck driving. The half marathon and 5K draws a large crowd each year and has many returning runners, such as Purdue alumnus Jason Hendrick and his wife Bree. The two make the trip from California oh. every year, so Hendricks can show his wife how beautiful Purdue is during the fall and visit with family. Aww. Friday night, hundreds of students from across the nation will build various computer products out of nothing by using computer code in a small amount of time. The Boilermaker Hackathon will last 36 hours, but don't worry, the competitors get breaks for food and such throughout the competition. Humans vs. Zombies will be taking place next week. <laughs> for those who don't know, it's a giant game of Nerf Tag with 200 to 450 people playing this year. So please do not panic when you see a bright orange piece of plastic. It's just someone gleefully murdering the undead from 1,000 meters or 20 feet. Unit conversion is hard. Murdering the oh! <laughs> The John Purdue Room will be keeping things local tonight with their first beer fest, which will feature local beers and a local band. Beer fest will include a five-course dinner prepared by students in the HTM 492 class, with each course having a matching local beer. The meals will feature a spin on traditional German street food and Bavarian cuisine. As long as I don't have to wear clogs and a lederhosen. This event, which is in its first year, hopes to bring the community together while showing off the skills HTM 492 students have learned. <laughs>